All right, everybody, I'm back with another good one. We got a little warm up to start off with, all right? We got five exercises, 30 seconds each, three rounds. We're gonna be working for about 10 minutes. This is gonna be a good one, y'all. Get ready to sweat. We're starting it all off with swing kicks. Here we go. So all we're gonna do, stand nice and tall. We're gonna swing, swing that right leg up. Aim for that left hand. Try not to plant that foot on the way back. All right, let's hit the other side. Okay, nice and easy. Remember, this is just a warm up. Feeling good about it? Continuing to try to keep that balance. Abs tight, looking good. Almost done. All right, first exercise completed. Heading into our in and out squat jumps. All right, in three, two, one. All right, on this one, we're gonna keep those knees nice and close. We're gonna go down into a squat. We're gonna pop those legs out into a deep wide squat. And we're just gonna keep going back and forth. Keeping that back nice and tall, abs contracted. Gonna look like a mountain gorilla here, okay? That means we want the shoulders higher than the hips. Feel good about it. Don't bend over. All right, we got a traditional exercise coming up now, all right? Gonna go right into them jumping jacks. In three, two, one. All right, on these jumping jacks, I want you guys to touch those fingers together on every rep. Landing nice and soft on those toes, making sure to breathe, okay? Well, the last thing you wanna do right now is start holding that breath. Feel good about it. Give your body what it's asking for. When that heart rate goes up, all it's asking for is oxygen. So keep breathing, keep feeling good about it. We are almost there. Got about five seconds. Three, two, stop. All right, we got skater lunges coming up. And three, two, one. Here, I think we talked about this before. You want to jump left, jump right. When you fall into that lunge, I want you to give me flexion in the knee, and I want you to explode so you get a little bit of vertical lift, and you're not just moving laterally, left or right, okay? You're gonna load that quad, and then we're gonna bounce off of it, all right? Feel good about it. 30 seconds. Nice. Everybody feeling good? I know I am. Warming up, getting ready to get into the workout. Did any of y'all notice that Muhammad Ali yoga mat? Yeah, going to do some nice peaceful yoga, but you representing with the badness. <laughs> All right, after this break, we're gonna jump right back into it, get another set, try to get that body warmed up. Okay, everybody, we're jumping back into those leg swings in three, two, one. All right, everybody, you should be getting a little bit more warmed up now. You should be able to stretch that leg out a little bit higher. You should be able to make a little contact with that toe if you wasn't making it before. But don't press. We still got another round to get warmed up. By the time we get to that third round, you should be good and ready to go. All right, switching to the other side in three, two, one. Now some of you might notice that you don't have as much balance on one side as the other. That's very common. Most people have some, you know, one side of the body stronger than the other, but that's why we practice these type of exercises to try to even it all out. So make sure if you lose your balance like I just did, take a second, squeeze the abs, 
get it back. Keep working. Don't just give up. All right, let's burn those legs up with in and out squat jumps in three, two, one. This is our second set of these. We've spent a lot of times on these legs, so we should be able to get a little bit deeper. We should be able to get a little bit higher. Maybe a little bit faster. But it's still a warm up. Work it out, warm up, breathe nice and deep. Feel good about what you're doing because you're doing more than a lot of people if you're just performing these exercises. All right, moving on to jumping jacks, y'all. In three, two, one. All right, I want everybody to keep focusing on keeping those abs contracted, okay? It's very easy to forget that. All movement starts with the core. We want to keep that core nice and engaged the entire time. Squeezing those abs. Pumping those arms. Working those calves. About to move on in three, two, one. Skaters lunge. All right, feel good about it, y'all. Pump them arms a little bit. Keep them biceps contracted. All right, you want to move a little bit, get a little extra work in, okay? Don't relax your body. Not only are you contracting that core right now, you want everything to be contracted. Yeah. Feel good, y'all. You're almost done. Heading into that second break. We got one more round, y'all. And then we're going to get into the real workout. We should be good warmed up after this. Hey, if you haven't stopped yet, stop. <laughs> we're done with that circuit. I forgot to tell y'all. My bad. That's what trainers do. We mess up the time and count some time. That's all right. Gonna get into it again in a second. Get ready. All right, one more time. Leg swings coming up in three, two, one. All right, everybody. I really want you to start focusing on what we got coming up. Make sure you're warming up good. Don't take the warm up light. Even though you're doing it at your own pace, you want to make sure you're good and warm and ready to start testing your body. Because this next circuit, when we start the real part of this workout, is going to test all of you. It sure tested me. All right, moving to that other leg in three, two, one. Okay, I just want to remind everybody, once we get into the workout, you're working at your own level. If you're just starting to work out, take it nice and easy. Don't push yourself. For those of you who are a little bit more in shape and you've been working with me, training with me, you can go nuts. All right, burning those legs up with in and out squat jumps in three, two, one. The whole time we're doing these exercises, I want everybody to focus on form, okay? When you start getting tired, first thing to go, is that form. So you're really gonna focus on trying to hold it all together. And if you can't keep your form right, take a break, rest, jump back in when you feel like you can do things right. All right, go on traditional jumping jacks in three, two, one. Hey, I just want all you to know that I'm very grateful that you came here to train at Usawa Fitness today. Thank you for clicking on my site, coming and working out with me. I hope you're getting stronger physically, mentally, and spiritually. I hope I'm providing the kind of service that you're looking for. And I understand that won't be the case for everybody, but I'm going to keep working to get better and better every day. All right, last set of skinny lunges. All 
right, everybody, we got a big old break coming up. In three, two, one. All right, feel good about everything we just did. That was the warm up. We're gonna take a little break now. Just gonna prepare for what we got coming up. Take some water, don't take too much. We gotta get, gonna be going up and down a lot here today. And I want you guys to spray your floor. So make sure you just take a little sip of water and get ready to get into it. Breathe, relax, enjoy your mind for a really good workout. All right, everybody, we're going into the workout. We got five exercises, 45 seconds each. We're going to do three rounds. We're going to have short breaks, 30 seconds. We're starting off with burpees in three, two, one. Everybody, protect your elbows. I don't want you jumping down to the floor. I do want you to squat down, put the hands on the ground, shoot the legs back, give me a push up, shoot the legs back in, jump up, and then we're gonna repeat. about to go into the next exercise. Standing side bends. All right, we're going in three, two, one. All right, standing tall, feet wide. Hands up high. I want those elbows at shoulder height. I want you to pull that knee up. You're gonna pull that same arm over right behind that knee. All right, and we're gonna shift to the other side. Feel good about it, guys. Keep going, this is an active rest. The next exercise is gonna be a little bit more cardio challenging. All right, we're going into that half plank. And then we're gonna to have to really use those abs so you may feel a little bit windy. Going in three, two, one. From the low plank, you're gonna start with those elbows directly underneath your shoulders. You're gonna reach back, you're gonna put one hand exactly where that elbow just left, you're gonna push up into the high plank position. Then you're gonna go back down. Now, you're gonna go up with the other arm. Put that hand exactly where that elbow left. Push up nice and tall. Back down, repeat. All right, we're going into those shuffle squats. Three, two, one. All right, on these shuffle squats, we're gonna give me a nice, good, solid squat, and then we're gonna shuffle those feet together. One, two, and then back to the original position, and we're gonna squat again. That's it, y'all. May feel a little goofy at first, but once you get your rhythm, you're gonna smash this, and we're gonna really get that heart rate moving. Next exercise coming up is the Swiss Knee Mountain Climber. All right, one in three, two, one. Okay, from this half plank, I want you to squeeze the ab. I want you to internally rotate that hip closed. And I want you to pull that knee up towards the opposite elbow. Continue to keep those abs squeezed. Push that foot back to the original position. And do the same thing on the other side. Internally rotating that hip, pulling that knee in towards the other elbow. Squeezing those abs while pushing that foot back to the original position. That's all we got to do. And three, two, one. Okay, that was the end of the first round, everybody. Let's rest up, grab a little water, and get ready for the second round.
Okay, going back to the second round of burpees in three, two, one. some active rest again with those standing side bends in three two one every time you pull that leg up and you push that elbow down I want you to give me a real tight contraction of the core okay keep that pace up make sure you keep those elbows up as high as your shoulders the entire time Ready. We're going back to that high plank, low plank in three, two, one. All right, let's go. I want you to keep the pace consistent. I do not want you to stop. But make sure you put that hand exactly where that elbow leaves, okay? Push it nice and tall. Working those triceps. Working that chest. Definitely working those abs. Up next, we're going into those shuffle squats. And three, two, one. One, two, squat. One, two, squat. One, two, squat. Let's go, y'all. Give me some nice deep squats. Give me some nice, nice, nice calf building shuffles. Back into those switch knee mountain climbers in three, two, one. Keep those abs nice and tight. Make sure you keep that butt up, shoulder level, and not let yourself go into an anterior pelvis tilt by dropping those hips. about to go into our second break everybody going into our second break in three two one all right feel proud everybody you just completed the first two rounds we got one round to go and we're going to start it all off with those burpees again Feel proud of yourself because you've done more today than a lot of people done in a long time workout wise. So let's get it. Going back to the burpees in three, two, one. All right, if you've been working with me, I want you to pick it up. This is the last round, so I want you to push yourself for all 45 seconds of each one of these exercises. This is the toughest one. Get in there, give me good solid push ups. Press. Let's go, everybody. Keep up that tempo. Stay motivated. Think about why you came here today. Came to get it in, so let's get it in. Was I tired when I was doing it? Hell yeah. But I kept going. Keep going, y'all. Finish it up. We 
We're almost done. We got an active rest coming up in this form of those side bends, standard side bends. We're gonna kick them off in three, two, one. Once again, as you pull that leg up, I want you to pull that elbow down. I want you to squeeze those abs. I want you to keep those elbows up at shoulder height. I want you to keep that foot coming up nice and tall, pulling that knee up with those hip flexors. Let's go. All right, we're moving right into the next round, a high plank, low plank. In three, two, one. Here we go. Make sure that you put that elbow directly underneath the shoulders, and when you go up into that high plank, you put that hand directly where that elbow just left. Keep those abs tight. Make sure you're not rotating those hips. Last round. See how many you can get. You should definitely get more than the first round, more than the second round. You had a 30 second break, so let's go. Come on, get it. All right, we're moving on here in three, two, one, double squats. Let's go. One, two, squat. One, two, squat. One, two, squat. One, two, squat. Let's go. One, two, squat. Deep squats. What we come here to do? Came here to get fit, so let's get fit. Don't stop. One, two, squat. One, two, squat. One, two, squat. One, two, squat. All right. We're moving on, last exercise in this circuit. Twist knee mountain climbers. Three, two, one. Ah, 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 ah. Yeah, feel good about it, everybody. We're doing this. We're finishing it all off. This is it. Okay, gonna push yourself. That heart rate is probably racing right now, but we're getting it. And if you gotta stop, then you stop. But I want y'all to push if you're capable of doing so and you're fit to do so. All right, that means that you've been working with me and getting it in for a while. If not, you gotta go at your own comfortable pace until you can get up to the speed where you can do this at a high level without putting yourself in harm. Get it. All right, we're ending it off in three, two, one. Congratulations, everybody. You reached a core cool down. We have four exercises. We'll be working for 30 seconds each. We've got three rounds, a 30 second break in between rounds. Probably go for about eight minutes, y'all. Here from the high plank, I want you to internally rotate that hip open, pulling that knee up towards the tricep. I want you to push that foot back down to the toe, and I want you to repeat on the other side. I want the inside of that leg looking at the floor every time you pull it towards the elbow. Our second core exercise is straight arm Russian twist. We'll be going in three, two, one. From that seated position, I want you to make sure you have those feet drawn in. I want you to make sure you have a nice flat back. I want you to go ahead and retract those shoulder blades slightly. And then I want you to turn at the hip with those hands straight out and above the head. Make sure you turn at the trunk and not just waving your arms around. Our third core exercise is Superwoman slash Superman. 
We'll be working for 30 seconds. We'll be going in three, two, one. Here with the abs contracted, all I need you to do is lay down on that stomach, lift those arms off the ground, lift those knees off the ground. Keep the abs contracted, both at the top and the bottom of the move. Make sure you keep your head in neutral spine by not pulling that neck back. All right, the last of our four core exercises are flutter kicks. We'll be going in three, two, one. All right, I want you to put your hands right up underneath the bunk. I then want you to try to work very hard to push your back in towards the floor to, and try to get that lower back flat on the floor. Lift those feet three or four inches off the ground and I only want you to go up about two feet, okay? Keep a nice neutral spine. You can lift that head off the floor, but don't push that chin into the neck. Three, two, one, take a break. All right, everybody, this is the point in the workout where I check out. I want you guys to enter your own personal space and think about why you did this, why you're going to continue to do this, or maybe why you stopped in the past. But either way, I wanted you to think about how you can make this an everyday part of your life. Take care, everybody. Peace. All right, going back to spider abs in three, two, one. back in to straight arm brush and twist in three, two, one. Got that superwoman slash superman in three, two, one. Flutter kicks, y'all. And three, two, one. Three, two, one, take a break. All right, we've got our final set of spider abs. Three, two, one. All right, let's get that last set of straight arm brush and twist. Three, two, one. All right, 
gonna fly away with that last round of Superwoman slash Superman. And three, two, one. Workout right now with flutter kicks. Here we go. Three, two, one. 